Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Hello, viewers. Today we will see how to calculate the weight of steel I section and tapered section using Excel sheet. So let's see. Now here we can see the two item I section and tapered section. And figure one is I section and figure two is tapered section. Now see the number of section one. And the section length one meter, and depth of section five hundred mm, and width of plates B, this one and this one one fifty mm, and thickness of plates T eight mm, and see the depth of wave D. This value from five hundred minus the thickness of these two planes and we can get the d value and see the thickness of wave thickness of wave 6 mm t and area of cross section is square millimeter that means the the two planes this planes and this planes area Plus the wave thickness, wave area. So we can get the area of cross section. And this section, cross section area is square millimeter. Now we, the volume of steel. Now see, this K4 divided by 10 to the power 6. That means the square millimeter convert to square meter, and multiply by the Number of section and length of section, so we can get the volume of steel. We also know the unit weight of steel, seven thousand seven thousand eight hundred fifty kg per cubic meter. So we just multiply the the volume of steel, so we can get the weight of steel. Same way, the tapered section. This is tapered section figure, and the number of section one length six meter, and see the wave size. One side is five hundred mm, and another is three hundred fifty mm. So input the value, and see the five hundred to three fifty. The width of lens one fifty mm. This one and this one, and The plane's thickness T is 10 mm, and same way the depth of wave small d, that is the average value 500 and 350 divided by 2 minus the thickness of the two planes. Then we can get the this d value 405. And thickness of wave, eight mm, eight mm, and now we can see the area, these two planes area and plus wave area. Same way, the this area convert to the square meter and multiply with the number of section and length of section, and multiply this this volume. To unit weight, so we can get the weight of steel. So if we change this, the so our weight also change. Like this is number of is two, then weight 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 all weight of steel will be changed. Same way the length of meter, like assume five meter, now change. Only red color mark we will change. Like this is 600 mm. Now weight also change. Same way we can change this value also. Like assume assuming 600 mm by 450, then weight also change. In such way we can the weight of steel easily. 